I'm Rafa Benito. Uh, you are watching the Redman TV. Jack, disappointed. Very much so. Um, yeah, thoroughly disappointing. <laughs> I mean, yeah, yeah, sure. Excellent. Thanks very much. Much like Chris has said, wind, wind out the sails well and truly early season. Um, I don't quite know what to say. I mean, the, on, the only plus I can think of is that you know we lost at home to Southampton last season. We're plus three points there. And yep. we lost away to City. We lost away to City tonight. We're plus three on last season. Let's look up and see where we can go. Excellent. But yeah, that's good. <laughs> there you go. That's as good a silver line as ever so far. Uh, I thought the Markovic coming off the bench, I thought the impact. Yeah, he looked lively. He's always got his head up and he looks to go forward and he's assertive. It's like, that's what I like in players. Players who look to assert themselves in games and get forward. Um, looking forward to seeing more of him. Mm. Any more positives for Liverpool to take on the pitch? Player wise? Um, first half, I thought we were very good and we handled being away to the champions very well up until sort of the halfway line, or like I said last week, the Sabutio line, if you like. Um, we were good up until that point, and I just thought we we didn't add much beyond that point. So I, I kind of feel like we're a strange paradox because. You'd expect that we'd go all out against lots of teams who are below us in the league and maybe go a bit more cautious, cautious against the teams who are in and around us in the league. I tend to think that we have more control against teams below us in the league when we go one up front and dominate the midfield yeah. and the full-back positions, whereas against the top sides, I always Should've prefer us going out. two up front and yeah. going for it. And um, it's, it's not really a logical way to play football, but it... it I get the impression it's the way it works for Liverpool and uh, under Rodgers and um, you know we'll, we'll see what happens against Spurs next week yeah. you know looking forward to it and, uh, <laughs> sounds <laughs> absolutely thrilled <laughs> at the prospect of Spurs at the weekend nice one Jeff that's half the price of Diego Costa, £12 million less than Lukaku or Herrera and the one that really fucking seals it for me only £13.5 million more than Ali Sissoko